up my friends, Jay here, and we're back bringing a gameplay, not a 30 second clip of bullshit that is uploaded from the Xbox Record, an actual Madden Ultimate Team head-to-head -head gameplay. We're gonna see I am currently running Arizona on offense, and I'm running cover two on defense. My opponents in New England on defense, and New Orleans on offense. And as you can see, we're moving the ball, and uh -oh. Dude straight disrespects me and hits me with a hot duke and fumble. And now we're gonna have to get a stop back. And he's coming out in the eye for him close. So we're hoping we can get a stop. And right here, I get thought he might run it again. Actually throws, got lucky on the overthrow there. Now we get third and eight. We're gonna go to some man coverage. Looks like he accidentally double tapped A for the quick hike. And he has to punt the ball. And basically, I said I'm gonna start playing again and uploading again. So here I am. To the five people that missed me we're gonna try to we're gonna we're gonna try to be consistent on the uploads because I'm enjoying the game there's no more of that bullshit disconnect losses and we're pretty excited about that and then oh gosh another fumble <laughs> oh, no. I tried to slide but we recover and we get lucky now we got a third and three we're gonna throw it to the outside get a nice little catch um, definitely just trying to get a feel for my opponent he was running four three under and scrape three blitzes so I'm just trying to get a feel for him and we're, we're running the ball right now because we know we can run versus the three four scrape three for the most part the four three under we're gonna want to pass in so we're just hoping to get the right look at the right time and right now we're just pounding the ball we're gonna give Clinton Portis some love and give him the ball back we're getting some yardage and one thing you're gonna be noticing about me compared to when I posted earlier is I do oh, run the <gasps> Sterling Sharp going huge! We get the touchdown. You're going to notice I play a lot of coverage defense, and then and I play a lot of good defense to stop the run, and then I send blitzes sparingly. And you're going to see that I have many blitzes that I can throw at people, but I just save it for the right time. As you can see, my opponent, when he's he's coming out and scrape three a lot of the time, just sending his blitz every single time. There, the pressure comes in. I forgot to send the spy. As you can see, this is a very effective coverage defense. What we want him to do is roll out, and we're going to send the spy at him. And it's very effective versus good players. So it's usually what I come out in and at first. And I see if I can stop your running attack with it. As you can see, we're, we're holding them right there. And then here, we hit Jordy Nelson, Nord, <laughs> Jordy Nelson deep on the deep post kind of route thingy. And then here we go under. I got lucky that wasn't picked. That was a poor read. I was I, did, I didn't think he was in man because he was baseline. So it was a good uh, good trick by him. Wasn't expecting that. Here we hit the corner route. Here he uses it. And we end up having the corner route again. And we threw it a little too late. We get out of bounds. And then here, I see he's open. And I'm just like, all right, we're gonna. I'm just gonna take my three, make a two-score game. A good situation that we're in. Good ball control. Um, he has ball, so we gotta stop here. We're gonna think it's pretty much over. And uh, he didn't really show too much on offense yet. So now he notices I'm playing that coverage defense. So he's trying to get the run going. And I'm hoping that I can hold, and make that play with Anthony Barr here. Perfect play by him. I am in man, so drags over the middle should beat me in man, and I gotta try to use it and recognize it there. The run D holds, so now we're gonna have a second and nine. He's gonna run a counter to the other at their misdirection, I think, and we stop him third and eleven, and the, we send the double B gap. Like I said, we 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 save our defense sparingly. He was coming out in a man beater. He had C routes on both sides of the field, and. We get hit with the Hadouk and fumble again. Now he's actually coming out in a wide trip shotgun and runs an inside zone there. Good call by him. Uh, I thought that I was sending a heat on that play there. I get lucky. He doesn't get out of bounds. Here he goes to the hitch route, and we jump it. Uh, you don't want to throw hitch routes like that. And then here he's going to take his three, and we're going to... We're basically going to play ball control. We're going to try to milk the entire fourth quarter and get away with the win. And we're going to see how our ball control is here. You see, we're going to run a little FB inside. Reggie Bush, welcome to the team. I do pass the ball out a lot of this formation, but I didn't so much of this game because I was already, I was like, I, God, I've already fumbled twice and kind of was like, let's just try to get out of this game with a win. 
And then there we get to the out route, uh, get the first down. As you can see, we're being very effective passing the ball. We've only thrown one incompletion so far. Here we're rolling to the outside. Caught me in man. Wasn't expecting it. Baseline man is a good trick. It's kind of something I don't expect. Um, there we go back to the out route on third and five. Pick up the first down. He, for the most part, had been giving me the out route. And in a lot of the time, in the early in the game, I wasn't going to it because he was running a lot of cover two. So I was trying to beat him. I have a, I have a really good cover two beater. And then here we go to FB dive. See, we hadn't ran it all game. See if he has defense for it. Um, not so much defense right here. As you can see, we're getting, we're getting steady yards. We're just trying to run out the clock. He's finally going to start to use his timeouts. Run into one more FB dive. And then we go to the toss. Blows up the toss. He wasn't, I didn't think that was good toss defense, but I probably should audible. We're going to take the three. And here we're going to kick it off. Basically, he needs a lot to go his way. For him to come back, and he hasn't shown anything on offense. So we're liking the situation that we're in. And here on first and ten, he's gonna roll out. We're gonna get the we're gonna get the block shed. That's what that defense is for. You you see this? I don't know. A lot of people don't will be like, "Wow, you're in fag D," and then other people will be like, "Wow, you're a nano bum." So I don't know what really is the preference of people. And he catches that little hail mary. Time runs out of the game, and that was a 42 yard bomb. And I think that was the total amount of yards he had all game. 42 yards passing, 16 yards rushing. So we held him to 58 yards, if my math is correct. And 42 of it came on that last play. So pretty good defensive stand by me. And as you can see, we're pretty efficient. Uh, didn't run the ball too well, but we did enough. And we were very efficient passing the ball, just dinking and dunking and got the big plays when we needed. But you can DS Peace.